Hey everybody and welcome back to Coffee with the Moms. It's Nicole and today I have a decent sized Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So I will get right into it. So we're going to start with some boring stuff. So if you can't tell my voice is a little nasally. I've been sick for the past couple days. So we've been, we ran out of Kleenex and as I've told you many times before I hate nothing more than to go to the grocery store on the weekend. <laughs> So, unless it's super early. So, I just grabbed some puffs, um, because I also, my husband has gotten sick at this point now, so yeah, so we're just, we're all doing great. <laughs> and then I bought, um, two bags of cotton balls, because I'm gonna do, um, with the kids for the Halloween party that I'm having, because at the daycare, I'm gonna have them make, um, my brain, see, my brain is not working, ghosts. Um, I'm going to cut out the ghosts and then have them put like the, you know, cotton balls on and then the ghost face on there so they can hang them up. So yes, so there's that. You know me and my lovely tape. I probably have 50 million of them. I probably don't need any more so I might need to stop doing that. But I just like to do it because then I can have them all over the house. Um, and then I found this great coloring book, this Toy Story 4 coloring book. Um, you can never have enough coloring books. So just nice, good you know, activity book. Um, this will probably just be in his stocking for Christmas. Um, and then they have the color forms. Um, and if you are around my age, I mean, they still have them. But the color forms are the um, the ones where they have the scenes and then they're like almost like the one, the stickers are almost like the ones that you would put on the window where you can take them off and put them back on again. They're just a little bit of a different texture. So color forms have been around forever. So I bought these. They have the Toy Story 4 color forms. Again, um, a Christmas gift. I'll put them in his stocking. He just loves stickers and these are nice because he can't really stick them to my furniture or my floor. Um, so yeah, that's great. <laughs> um, and I also bought, if I can grab them all, so I can show you all at once. Um, I bought more of those stickers. I all, Like I said before, as long as they have them, I'll grab like three at a time. And I've said this before, do I think that these are worth a dollar a piece? No, but it's just something fun. Again, that will be going right into his, um, I'm just trying to see if they're in the bag. That will go right into his, um, his stocking. And then I needed some bags for lunches because my husband brings sandwiches all the time. And this was a 125 pack. And they're, they don't have the zipper tops. They actually just have the ones where you fold and seal, um, which I thought was a nice um, something to something different to try because the other one had only had the one with the actual like not zipper top but you know what I mean um, they only had 45 in there so I figured one, 125 um, bags for a dollar we'll see if they work um, I mean they're in a lunch pail too so I think this will be fine but I'm just gonna see how these work try them out uh, and then so his school um, asked for for their um, their Halloween party that they have they have all the kids trick-or-treat around the different rooms and they asked um, for just some little donations and I figured I can go to the dollar store and spend four to five dollars to help out his class. So they asked for paper bags and so I just bought these cute ones. They were 12 to a pack. Now some of them, which I went to go grab the other ones, were only eight to a pack. So just make sure if you, if they still have these at your store, just make sure you look because I mean I feel like 12 is a great deal. Um, so hopefully they can use these ones. If not, um, they'll probably just give them back to me. But so I got 12 of these bags for a dollar. And then they also, they so they asked for like non-candy things or like individually wrapped things. So I, end, and they asked for like pencils. So I just got two packs of 12 pencils because I figured um, they can give the kids one or two or they can spread them out between other rooms. And they're just the same. I got the same ones, but they just have three different, you know, um, some have like ghosts on there. These ones have like mummies and black cats and like, um, Frankenstein on there if I can get close enough. These ones have like candy corn and these ones just say like spooky and eek and then this one right here they have like um, um, a witch and like a spider and like Frankenstein on there. So I thought these were cute. I thought the kids would like these and they were just you know still Halloween stuff that they had left over um, that I decided to get for them. And then I also got um, I also got some Toy Story 4 stickers to give to the class because they asked for stickers too. And I figured there's four to there's four to a sheet, or there's four sheets in each one. So I figured I think he has 
six or seven kids in his class, so I figured this would be enough at least for his class um, to use, so I'll have to send those off in his backpack for them. Uh, but I just figured I'd help out a little bit. You know, I mean, they they take care of him, and they're teaching him, and he just loves it there so much, so I figured to help out wouldn't be a bad thing. So I have a bunch of birthdays in November. I have four birthdays in November. So I bought a couple birthday cards while I was there just to be up on the game so I don't forget because this time of year it starts you know things start to get a little bit busier so this really nice brother-in-law birthday card just has some nice stuff in there I'm not going to read it all because it would make this video very long but I just thought that was a nice kind of different one and then this is for my husband uh this one's pretty funny it's basically saying like he's the head of the house but I'm like the CEO and all that stuff, which I pretty much am the CEO. I run this place. Like, I run this place. And then this is just, um, it's a birthday card for my mom, but I always get her, like, the grandma ones, like they're from my son. Um, and so, I mean, to buy two, I mean, I guess I could buy two cards, but I just feel like it's such a waste. Like, she really just wants one from him. So, you know, I got her this beautiful, beautiful um, mother's, uh, mother's Day card, um, birthday card for my mother. <coughs> All right, and then, so now we can get into the Christmassy stuff. I'm pretty sure. I had sworn I had grabbed three of those things. I must have only grabbed one. I'm so sad about that. That stinks. Okay, anyways, so I love these little things. They last forever. They have the metal on the back of them. So um, just to hang around the, and listen, I don't need any more Christmas decorations, but like these are just so easy to hang and just get a command hook and hang them up. Um, and the kids will just like like these sparkly things around because I love Christmas. So I want it to look like a Christmas wonderland. I want it to look like Christmas threw up um, in the kids downstairs like playroom that they're that they play in that the daycare kids play in. So I thought this was really cute. Just as Merry Christmas, a little little sparkly stocking. And like I said, these ones last forever because they have the metal back on them. They're not like cheap cheapy cheapy ones so I like this and if you really wanted to you could just you could make this your own and just take all this stuff off if you really wanted but I'm just gonna leave it on just like this um and I also got I could have sworn I grabbed my brain is not functioning properly I could have sworn I grabbed more stuff but I guess I didn't Yes, I didn't. I don't think I missed a bag. I'm pretty sure I didn't lose a bag. I thought this one was, see, this is what happens when I'm sick. My brain just does not work properly. Um, I thought this was super cute because it looks like a sleigh and it has Santa and a reindeer on it. And I figured I could hang this either upstairs or in a window or like on a door, on the bathroom door or something like that just for the kids to look at. I just thought this was really sweet and cute. I love these types of things. So very cute. I mean, I feel like for a dollar, you can't go wrong. And there's a little sparkle on there, but nothing crazy. And then, oh my gosh, these were so cute. I had to get them. Because if you, if you haven't seen, I have like a couple little ones that are I have like a skeleton and like a vampire one that's like these felty type of ones but look at this I'm sure this isn't new I'm sure they had this last year but look at this little cute elf and you can move his legs and his arms oh so freaking cute so yeah I got him I thought he'd be cute to hang up and I also of course I had to had to because they they actually had this nicely so like so that the arms and legs weren't bent because some of them do get bent if they have them out. Um, so they're pet, so they're leaving them all folded in, which I think is a really good idea. And I got Santa, so I'll hang up Santa too. I just love these cute little things for the kids. They love it. They just like looking at them. They have fun. They're just cute decorations. And then upstairs around my clock, I have like two hooks, and I normally hang like um, the pumpkins and stuff like that up there. But I thought these were super cute sparkles are everywhere but they just look like um little ornaments so it's this one says merry christmas and this one says let it snow so i figured these would look good right next to the clock I have like a huge oversized clock so these are really i mean they're nice and sturdy too they're not like thin cardboard or anything um they're made to look like wood but they're not it's not like planks of wood it's just like the way that the picture is printed on there um and yes there is some sparkle on e each of these but just a little hairspray is good. I also got him some Santa socks. They finally had the socks out. They finally started putting more stuff out because I went like two two weeks in a row and it was like the same stuff and I'm like when is the rest of the Christmas stuff coming out because like this is crazy. 
and I'm sure they're going to put even more out because there was still Halloween stuff out. So I'm hoping that they put more out and I can get a couple more new things. So I did get him these cute little Santa socks. And then, and you know, I love, love, love the window clings. So, and I need them for the daycare. Um, so, and the kids just love looking at them. So I actually went a little crazy and they had more. Um, but they had them all, I'll, I'll explain, I'll explain. Okay, so these ones, and these are the little bit of thicker ones that I like to put on the front door. Um, and these are really cute. And this is the only one they had in this type of, where it's got like the, the silver around it. These are the only ones. I'm sure they had other ones. Maybe they just weren't put out yet, or they were all gone at the moment because I went on a Saturday morning. So now these ones are great too, <clears throat> and there's so many. Um, so they have... This one, so I thought these were really cute to put on the window. And I just like it because you can reuse them next year. So it's like an investment almost. And for a dollar, like you really can't go wrong. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was really, really cute. Um, now, so they had all these dishes. So I have three more here. They had all of them stacked behind each other. So you had to literally take off one stack to get to the next. And I'm like, can't you just put, I mean, they have enough room in there. They could put them eat like they and there were more than just these five. There were a couple more and I was like, I don't need any more. So I got these ones. And then look at these, all these cute little cupcakes. Cute cupcakes. So I like these with the snowflakes on there and the pieces of candy. And then they had the gingerbread men with the gingerbread house and some Christmas presents, gumdrops, candy canes, trees. Very, very, very cute. So you could even kind of do like your own theme if you wanted only one. And then I got some more with like Santa and the reindeer and his cute little elves. And like I said, they had, a, I think they had like two or three more, but they were just stacked behind each other. And I was like, I'm not, I'm not doing that. I'm just not. Um, and then this, they have, these are wall clings. So I'll put these on the wall. Um, <clears throat> so if you can see those. And those just go right on the wall. They're pretty cool pretty cute. Um, they're just like the window ones, but they just actually stick on the wall. And then I got some of this garland. They have a bunch of different garland. I might go back and get a, like a different one, but it has just like the holly berries and all that on there. Um, <clears throat> so I thought that these, this was really cute. I'm probably going to use this. I might use this, um, to make a centerpiece out of, um, I'm not sure yet. Um, and then they have these cute little buckets. Um, they had a different, another one, but I liked this one. It had the trucks on it and it just says dashing through the snow. I thought this was really cute. I mean, I could put, you know, the activities for the day in here, um, for the kids. I mean, I could just fill it up with stuff and just leave it out as decor. You could really use this for a lot of things and it's just a nice hard plastic. So I really, really loved this too. But yeah, that is what I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, like I said, they had a bunch of new stuff out. They had a bunch of socks. Um, but yeah, I was like waiting for them to put all that out because on their Instagram, they had like this video of, oh, come check us out. We have all of our Christmas stuff out. And I'm like, yeah, not mine. Like, and I was like, oh, it's all out now. Like, because it was their official like Dollar Tree Instagram. No, 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 no. It was not everybody. It was just that maybe a main store or a big store that they have somewhere. I don't know where. But yes, so they finally are starting to get more of the Christmas stuff out, ready and to go, even though it is still October. I don't care. I hear people make comments like, oh, it's not even. But listen, when you do crafts and you have kids and you have to think of things ahead of time and you can't just like go and buy things all the time, like you kind of have to plan and get things going and get the ball rolling. But yes, and I like to do Christmas shopping early, so... For me, stocking stuffers are a great idea to get to the from the Dollar Tree. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, Dollar Tree haul. And we will see you guys soon. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. And please don't forget to hit that bell notification so you guys are notified anytime Lisa or I decide to post a video. All right. Bye, guys.